Jermaine, congratulations on the two goals. Um, did you feel like you deserved something from today's game? Yeah, definitely. I mean, even when they scored their second, I think we were top of the game at a point, you know. And you know, if we'd come off there and lost that two one, you know, people might have been talking that. I think it didn't, it wouldn't have done us any justice. So, you know, to get um, the goal when we did and um, the way we did that, um, really happy that we got a draw out of it. Have you come off feeling happy you got the point, but really knowing that there's still a lot, lot of things you need to work on? Oh, without doubt, you know, um, there's so much more to work on. I'm just happy that we got a point out of that because that's the least we deserved, I feel. Um, but um, defensively as a team, we're conceding way too easily. Um, you know, if where we want to be, we can't, we can't get anywhere just conceding. Um, the fact it was only 2-1, you know, they could have scored just before half-time as well to make it free, and that's happened a few weeks. They've gone through one up and, you know, we've been out of the game before. You know, but the fact we were still in the game at 2-1, you know, even in the 93rd minute or 90th minute when it was always stand a chance and after we got the draw. Yeah, you set the goal up at Berry, didn't you, early on with the run. You, you came on and did really well against Plymouth and then you've obviously scored twice a day. Do you feel like your form is improving? I feel, yeah, um, that um, my form's improving. Um, I feel to, I need to stand up and be counted a bit more, especially when things ain't going so right, um, you know, for us. But um, I want to obviously be adding more goals to my game. You know, I want double figures this season without doubt to contribute like that. But, you know, it's just still a bit frustrating no matter what um, individually you're doing. You want, as a team, to be getting results on the pitch. You know, that's what matters. And, you know, so there's a lot of characters you know, um, in the dressing room, we're really trying to be together, and you know, it's a good togetherness, and we've got to keep that going. Yeah, let's talk through the first goal. I mean, Terry Gornell returning the favour from last week, really good ball through, and then looked like you could have gone there, and but you, you did well to stay on your Yeah, feet. it's one of those. Yeah, you know, I felt that I felt the clip, and I thought, and you know, I'm not on pen, so you know, I thought, you know, if I don't score this, and I've not gone down, you know, they'd be on to me, but. Um, um, luckily, I uh, just kept my head and hit the target, and you know, it's nice to see it going. Yeah, a 92nd minute goal is always nice to see. Talk me through that one. Just seemed to get there before the goalkeeper and put it underneath him. It was one of those. I was just, you know, I saw it. as soon as Stevie played it in. Um, it's a great ball from him, by the way. But as soon as he's played it in, I've just made sure. You know, I saw the defenders in front of me. I've just got a toe on it, and you know, luckily it's just it's trickled in. I was just relieved to see it. Um, you know, I think the defender got a bit hurt, but I was just. 100% wanted to get onto that and you know it meant so much so it's nice to get a goal as well. Yeah I think you, you did get a brace but Sido was claiming wasn't he a couple, uh, a couple of seasons ago uh, so oh, I yeah. don't know whether it actually was a brace or not because yeah. did, 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 do you think I thought oh, there was no doubt about today's goals anyway? Yeah yeah I know so um, I don't want to claim none of these two but um, yeah it's always nice to get a brace a little, just a little bit frustrated uh, we didn't get uh, the three points but um, you know as long as we're not we didn't lose today and I feel that you know draws at least was Got. Yeah, you're not quite playing with with great fluidity at the moment, but it is silly mistakes that seem to be costing you, isn't it? The goals that are going in must you must be frustrating because they seem to be so avoidable. Yeah, it is. I mean, you know, from from Sundays we're looking at the DVDs even, and you just it's so it's it's more horrible looking back on it, and it's some it's the most frustrating thing is it's the mistakes we're making. You know, silly goals are not worldies, and that it's just you know we're not giving each other protection, which is what we did a lot last season. So the quicker we cut that out, um, the better, and you know, we've got a bit of a lifeline to you know even get the draw today, and that even though it is the least we deserved, you know, but. It's just one of those where um, it's not happened um, defensively, and to be fair, we've, we've lost defenders as well, and for injury, and that we've not we've not been blessed at the moment with that. But you know, um, hopefully, this draw and that we can kick on from here and then start getting some results together in the yes. run. Has the manager said anything specifically to you about what he wants? Because he said he wants more people to be nailing, nailing down places. As you said, what you need to give him. I'm sure, sure a brace is a good start to that. But has he told you what else he wants? Yeah, it is. It is a good start. Um, yeah, he um, he wants. Anyone like I think Bar Brownie really hasn't really nailed down the place, and I think that's what we've got to be doing more. And you know, um, you know, he just puts a bigger team that wants to get results. You know, he knows where he wants to be. He knows where each individual wants to be. And now I think you know individuals like Noble. And I think um, you know a lot of praise goes to him. He, he he made a big difference in there today. He wants to get on the ball, and you know he encourages me to make them runs that I want to make. Where we, when we had the lots of pack in there as well. So you know. Uh, hopefully um, we can get more of a, a, a recognisable starting eleven every week, and then you know that's good for team morale and you know good confidence as well. So hopefully that brace um, you know, keeps me going and uh, long may it last. Yeah, it looks good on paper, doesn't it? The squad as good as it has done, you know, but oh, it's yeah. just got to produce it now. Yeah, even you know even before we had some players, even pre-season, I looked at it and I thought you know we'd definitely be up there, but you know games ain't won on paper, are they? You know you got to, we got to, I think it's just we got to earn the right to earn the right to get to where we want to be, and you know I think we have got to do the nitty gritty stuff and defend clean sheets as. Uh, how many clean sheets we've got last season we've got a lot so I think that's obviously a key part of our game because we'll score goals at the other end yeah definitely. brilliant cheers mate